Good evening, and welcome to Master Stream Theater. Um, or, in fact, quite inexpert stream theater, where I will be streaming uh, what I can manage, I believe is the technical term. And hopefully you will be enjoying what I can manage. What I can manage is playing a little bit of guitar, I can play a little bit of piano, I can vaguely look at a saxophone and possibly even get the mouthpiece in my mouth without hurting myself. I have not yet been slayed by a random errant uh, splinter of a uh, size four of a hardness four reed, so that's good at least. Um, I'll be playing a little bit of bass, a little bit of left-handed, a little bit of right-handed. This is the multi-music mat stream. If you are looking for specialization or competence, you may have come to the wrong place. Uh, this is a place where I attempt various things that occur to me and often fail. So if you enjoy watching someone fail and sort of resiliently not care about that, then you've definitely come to the right place. Uh, hopefully you will participate in our community. Please say something in my chat room, um, follow the stream, uh, perhaps make a post about one of my crazy videos saying, who is this wacky insane man who believes that he can play all these instruments? Um, or, or not. Um, if you're interested in the kind of stuff that I do, uh, you can participate. Uh, you could you could flame or troll if you want to. I could certainly use an antagonist. Uh, the stream doesn't yet even have an antagonist. So if you hate what I'm doing, if you think I'm doing it wrong, if you want to comment uh, on any every negative thing you can think of, that's fine because it'll drive the algorithm, create engagement, and create some sort of fan base. And technically, I uh, don't mind if the internet wants to yell at me as long as I can monetize my videos at the end of it. So um, with that in mind, give me one second. I'm just going to pop in a little bit of Rocksmith here, and turn to the left-handed guitar, I believe, to start my day. Later today, we might be experimenting, uh, not necessarily with good saxophone tone, because that is not yet possible, but we might be experimenting just a little bit with the cardio effects of playing saxophone, because yesterday I knocked myself out. I mean, not quite, but... It certainly, uh, it certainly was very close to unconsciousness, and then I had to literally go sleep off all of the long tones, which was a strange experience. I, uh, I enjoyed it. It was, was kind of odd. It was like running a marathon while sitting in one place. So that's useful, uh, potentially for a variety of reasons. It might be, in fact, quite healthy. Um, never occurred to me that playing a woodwind instrument could be so good for things like lung capacity, which will help me in other aspects of my life. Um, such as screaming at ChatGPT when it doesn't program things correctly. Err! <laughs> Angie GPT. Ooh, that's a good one. Hold on. <laughs> People might use Angie GPT. <laughs> it's like, I want to I wanna, I wanna get really mad at someone, but I'm not feeling it. Help me, computer. Computer gets all angry for you. A GPT that helps you practice the dozens with someone. I have no idea who this person is. If, if, someone, if you hear someone speaking on the stream, I suggest that you consult a uh, mental health professional immediately. Hearing high-pitched girl voices is a sign of dementia precox, I believe, so watch out. Um, Call your exorcist. <laughs> At least that's what uh, that's what the uh, psych manual I read from uh, 1947 said. Rocksmith. Why is this so much fun? It's weirdly fun. I'm telling you folks, and I'm not gonna do somebody else's bit, but technically, I was alive first and, li and watching Rodney Dangerfield movies first, but I'm not, I'm not gonna rip off their bit. But I'm telling you folks that, uh, <laughs> that, uh, geez, I don't even know what I'm telling you. Maybe I should do more, uh, do more scales. Something about this guitar, I, I just don't want to change the strings on it because I'm not 100% sure I will ever get strings that are just quite as good as these. I like want to contact the manufacturer of the guitar. 
and say, what are these beautiful strings? So my hollow bodies, I am I am 100% addicted. The only thing I wish is I wish it had a tiny bit more of a realistic resonance. Because you can't really... Um, I'll, I'll turn off, uh, very quickly, I'll turn off the audio from the <laughs> the amplifier, amplifier being my computer, and just, it doesn't really have any resonance to the unamplified E string. You can vaguely hear it, but it's, it's pretty obviously an unpowered electric guitar in this configuration, whereas the semi-hollow body, in my opinion, um, ring of the, the way the B string sounds. I just, I'm sorry, I just love the B string. Like it is, uh, I know a lot of people are E string people and that's totally cool. It's really hard to go wrong with just the natural notes on the E string. I mean, I just... It sounds like you know what you're doing. That's that's really uh, my favorite thing about the major scale, is as soon as you internalize the major scale, um, the major scale pattern on the guitar, suddenly it sounds like you know what you're doing. You don't necessarily really have to know anything, but... <laughs> I wish if I if I could change anything. I spent a lot of time on my beloved blues. Got off into the Rust scale there for a second. I do love the Rust scale, but I'm not going to have to play it yet. Um, I'm not necessarily here to flaunt my skills. That's not really what I do. Um, the closest thing I have to skills with a guitar, guitar key. are here in this um, in this gaming world. I'm a gamer first, um, definitely, long before uh, ever picking up any musical instrument or really even being able to walk or talk or function. Um, I was playing video games. The first video game I consciously remember playing was Dig Dug, uh, if you're old enough to even know what that is. <laughs> um, I actually played on an Atari 2600, and I swear I've seen a 5200, but I'm not sure I ever actually spent much time with it. But I've played stuff like, uh, you know, Stargate Defender and all of the old classics. So um, this very much appeals to me because these are like those games. They remind me very much of my childhood and provide just a critical little layer of abstraction or distraction. Um, if I were going to make a suggestion to anyone who is attempting to learn the guitar, at least as an adult, um, I would say just a little bit of distraction can be amazingly useful. I find the stream and the games to be a good way to just uh, not feel like I'm sitting here simply learning how to fret properly. Of course, everybody needs to know how to fret properly. I've got my guitar turned up very, very high right now. All I'm trying to do is just play real smooth and not get any false positives. Um, which later, hopefully, if I practice this enough, I'll be able to play music quite delicately. And in my opinion, uh, fast, delicate style players, like really good flamenco players, um, really oh, fail. are really the most impressive kind of players. So for me, I do like to turn my guitar up and attempt to play it very softly. I find that really motivating, um, just to see if I can get sort of a gentle sound out of it. And I say that, but actually, this thing is turned way down. Which might explain, oops, <laughs> A little of the difficulty I'm having. Oof. So I just 
up way too high for my skill level. As you can see, I'm getting things like double shots. Ah, combo breaks all over the place. Um, from my point of view, if you wanted to make it like a challenge, one of the things you could try doing is just maybe uh, a couple of friends or something could sit around and say, who can turn the guitar up to the highest uh, numerical setting and still get uh, good scores in the Just, I don't know, just for fun. Um, I do not imagine myself as the next Ingve Malmsteen, that's for sure. Um, those, to me, those kind of guitarists, those real amazing experts, um, are the kind of people who sacrifice, they sacrificed a lot. When I think of an amazing guitarist, I think of somebody who, instead of taking the day off and going to the park, they sit around and tread. And I just, you know, I'd love to have a guitar. But it does take, as an adult, certainly it takes a lot of effort. Um, we all have those, you know, those golden years of youth where you get to use whatever advantages you start with to try to propel yourself forward on a career or a skill set or something. Um, I think I probably chose, if, if you may notice, uh, oratory, possibly as my original focus. I had a lot of early emphasis on verbal performances, and so maybe someday this can be used. I, I don't see myself certainly as ever being uh, James Hetfield. I think Arlo Guthrie or something along those lines, something more approachable might be more my style. But who knows? Uh, shredding certainly could be fun. It's um, difficult to imagine a person like me ever really getting the finger speed of the great master. But I have decent dexterity, so I think I'll, I think I'll be middling, and then we'll fall back on a bit of storytelling skill, which is actually what I started my life thinking that I would be. But I don't know. Uh, stories are told differently now, and I'm not sure that my uh, original plan would be that of but who knows, maybe there will be a revival someday of the long talker. Speaking of long talking, I'm still just sitting here, long talking, oops, and missing friends, that was supposed to be a D, folks. I dropped the D. The way my mind works, um, my left brain and right brain seem to work exceptionally well in, in tandem, not necessarily in alternating uh, sequence, right? So if I sit here and talk and just sort of amuse myself by speaking what, to what I assume must be uh, probably quite an empty room at this time, if I amuse myself in that fashion, it does help me get a slightly higher score. And as soon as I begin to over-focus on the actual playing, I'm more likely to A, make mistakes, and B, take ill-advised risks. Uh, and that's probably just my mentality vis-a-vis -vis gambling and that sort of thing. A lot of the decisions in these games are gambles. If I had just stayed on one fret and kept firing, I would have got them. pickups. Uh, I do love this guitar, but it was only a few hundred dollars on, in fact, I don't even think it was a few hundred dollars, on Amazon, and 
it has the electronics that you would expect. I, I'm not expecting anyone to somehow fit $300 um, MOSFETs and the like into a guitar that only cost a hundred and something dollars. So, I'm just very appreciative that they've made something so durable. Um, I will, in fact, in just a second, I'll get you the name, oops, of this brilliant little guitar. Sorry, I lost my place. Hmm. Not on the right string there. <coughs> hmm. But this uh, particular guitar, if you notice there, is a Grot. Um, I really, really like this guitar. Um, so far, it's my favorite. If I had to pick one to take out of the house in the midst of a fire, it would definitely be this one. All right. Now, uh, I've tried on the highest difficulty. Let's see about making this just a little more reasonable for actually achieving some sort of score. Hey, actually making some real progress this time. They have to be basically perfect in, in order to get a nice high score at this. I think the Ducks game could probably be the best beginner game. Oh, 48 million. Oh my god, what the hell? Shit. Pardon me. I was about to high score. What the heck? 
I got way better at this at some point. I haven't played this game in a while. Dang. Oh, wait, but this is left-handed. I think I do have... I think I still have a higher score with the right hand on this. Otherwise, it would be giving me the name of someone to beat. But if I check the records there, it'll probably say pretty clearly that my right hand is still higher rank. So this is for my lefty honor. Again, I don't know. I would love to conduct a neurological investigation into the in, into which handedness applies oops wit when to the guitar. Because this feels like I'm doing this right-handed is how I would describe this right now. Right? I mean my left hand is barely engaged. streak, so unlikely to get a high score of any kind, though. Ah! Oh, see, I'm not, I'm not gonna be Yngwie Malmsteen anytime soon. <laughs> However similar the fame, <laughs> no matter how similar the nose and, and D cross is. <laughs> Fairly easy to get accidental, haha, <laughs> unintentional shots. Um. Oh! Oh, the pain. The freaking pain. Oh, the pain of failure. Still managed to, like, just sort of angie it out. Ooh! Ooh, a mistake. That doesn't feel good. Oh, hello kitty. I'm sure you'll be very helpful in this game. Who's my little ash ghost? Oh, sorry folks. Humans should not have to hear other humans talk to their cats. <laughs> Yep, this is the only stream with the shaking of cat treats on. I bet that's not true, actually. I've seen those streams. I like cat streams. We were thinking of doing a cat stream if this fails. Not even kidding. Oof, speaking of failure. You shall not pass, shield duck. I'm actually doing this just to get blood to run back into my hair. <laughs> so yeah, I've had a good Rocktober. There's still about a week left in Rocktober to get some serious practice hours in. If you have been participating in Rocktober, please let me know how many hours you managed to practice and on what instruments this, um, this month. It's a good month for practice and it's harvest time. The human mind sort of turns itself to celebration as the sheaves come in. And so, in doing so, we probably find ourselves wanting to make a little music. That's a good atavism to have. A 
of all of our instinctual inclinations, music might be the healthiest. I don't know. Maybe hugging. It's hard to say. feels good. Pure high scorium. Oh, 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 the fail. Ouch. Hey, 74 million, I'll take it. <laughs> I do love the high scores. Yeah, I dare say. But my up, my right hand's still higher, yeah? Yeah. Not bad. So my right hand's still at 81 million. And I'm only in position 2,000 on this game. I got some, got some work to do. Pardon my counting, folks. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh! One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Woo! That's close. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Not gonna be a high score now. Literally no chance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Ah, oh, dead. Pathetic. 20 million. Nothing. See, it's all about streak in this game. Shots fired. Entirely sorry, I was thinking about something else. Pardon me, folks, I will be back for one in one second.
Whoa! Uh, it's the, it's actually all the same. Right, given the current, given the deadline situation. Hey, hey, careful, careful. I'm on stream. Oh. Hey, everybody, sorry, we sold something. It was nice. <laughs> um, as much as I would love to do this for a living, I do not yet have the following for that. If you want to help me join um, the ranks of the illustrious tubers and streamers of the world, I would certainly appreciate having you follow and like the stream. Uh, but I will have to be back in just one second because unfortunately I do have to work for a living even on the afternoon sometimes. So I'll be right back.
Hey folks, we're back. Sorry about that. I'm vaguely cheating, folks. I took some energy gum. I gotta say, I can get my caffeine anywhere, but this Alpha GPT gum is amazing. Um, I'll do one quick little free, little free advertisement here. Not like anybody's particularly watching. This stuff, really good. Really enjoy it. Strike gum. Give it a try. Really good stuff. Very minimal jitters. It's not like normal energy stuff. Very smooth. should be counting shots. Unfortunately, I don't know where to start. I'm guessing 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, that was really sad. God dang it. Technically, that was wrong, but it counted it, so I'll take it. Oh, I shot at the shield duck. Should have shot the rainbow duck. Yeah, unfortunately, I got to do some off-screen uh, off practice with a metronome. I'm not sure anybody wants to watch me sit here play quarter and eighth notes. Scales on a metronome. Well, that is technically, I would say, the next big step for my development as a musician is to be able to play in time with other musicians. 
noodling is great, but it's not going to get me any gigs, obviously. I'm starting to think about gigs, right? I mean, I was watching a video the other day and an advertisement came on that was actually kind of useful. It reminded me that there are birthday parties, um, various kinds of celebrations, weddings, let's see, uh, bar mitzvahs, quinceañeras, sweet 16 parties, probably a bunch of stuff I don't even know about, but the actual demand for somebody who can uh, play, you know, without hum humiliating themselves and take a couple of requests, as my, uh, my friend keeps pointing out, that being able to take requests is the number one skill for a, uh, a party player. I'd totally forgotten about party players. But that's 100% a real thing. Restaurants, birthdays, big events, corporate events, I, thought of, I hadn't thought about that. Like the sheer number of actual jobs out there for people to play guitar is pretty high. Never occurred to me. I was raised to believe this wasn't a way to make money. Think that might have been mistaken because it looks to me. Oops, gambled, gambled and lost there on that uh, on that rainbow duck. But it uh, definitely looks to me as if a person could make a viable living. I mean, if I'm understanding the pay rates, a person could easily do three gigs a week of the right type. And, and keep their lights on. And that's pretty great. That's not that much work. Once you've done the practice. So I would say, if you were an aspiring musician, aspire. I didn't know. If I'd known it was going to be this easy, I would have done this 20 years ago. Not even kidding. Everybody always said, oh, learning music, oh, learning the guitar, it's so hard. And maybe it was before Rocksmith. I could see that. But today, it's easy as you please. This right here, I don't even feel tired. Doesn't even seem like work. Holy shit. I mean, holy... Holy Shasta. And then of course I mess up. Because I wasn't expecting to win. Alright. If you are watching this on YouTube, Please consider tuning in to the Twitch stream, especially on Mondays. Mondays are when we're going to try to make a little bit of a push. If you have any interest in the left-handed guitar, the so-called left-handed guitar, um, I do play left-handed, or at least most of the time. And so if you're wondering um, just any special things about playing left-handed, please feel free to ask me what I've, uh, what I've picked up so far. I'll be happy to share. I forgot muting. Muting is maybe the most important thing in this game. And counting, which I'm not doing. Let's guess we're at five. Six. Seven. Ooh. 
One, two. What was wrong with me? That one literally just did not register. <laughs> I'll take 27 million, but I need to start counting again or I'm not gonna get anywhere. All right, let's try to count our way to the top. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Hands are getting sweaty. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Oh, oh hey! That was a technically a mistake. <laughs> 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, that was technically a mistake too, I'm, this is pure luck, or my back brain smarter than my front brain, 1, oh, I don't even know anymore, I lost count, 2, 35 million, that's serviceable. Slightly less than halfway where, to where we want to be. Arg. Hmm. See, ironically, I think the fact that I'm quote unquote better at this on the uh, so-called right-handed guitar, since this is the fretting game, actually further proves that I'm left-handed, right? Anyway, let's go ahead. 
three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Let's not. We're not gambling today. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Oh, oh. Still a chance to say that. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. <laughs> if I played the right string, I might still be in the game. I just realized you can see where the next duck is going to come from. I, I'm pretty sure I've been playing this game wrong. Oh my god. Oh, derp. Alright, start. time to start counting. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, not eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Sixteen, seventeen. Oh, that was that was just a mistake. I felt stupid. One, two. This is like being able to see the future. I've been I've apparently been playing this game blind all the time. Now let's see if I can actually turn this into a streak and not screw up horribly. I feel so dumb. I cannot believe this game has always had this feature and I never noticed. Probably should have been counting those. Tennis. Let's say fourteen. Stop mistaking the five for the seven. Ah, I feel so stupid. I can't believe I keep doing that. One second, folks. I'm gonna um, clear my head. Hey, Rebecca, can you bring bring me my um, head clearing device? I think I was clearing my head in the in the uh, bedroom most recently. I often get stuffy. Right before bed, I have to clear my head out. Yes, make some clouds to sleep on. It's clearing my head. Sorry. I'm not going to be the 875th long haired white man to write a song about marijuana this year. <laughs> <laughs> It's 
like, uh, newsflash, newsflash, everyone. A long-haired, middle-class Caucasian man, middle-class, middle-aged Caucasian man loves marijuana. Uh, film at 11. Not that that has anything to do with my uh, current head-clearing activities. This is the sound of me lighting an ear candle, obviously. That's perverse, man. I don't need people to see that. I don't think I don't need to see people to see me sticking things in my holes on camera. If I wanted to do that, there's a whole other website. Nyak nyak nyak. Sorry. Just uh <coughs> Just clear my head out here. Just uh my favorite thing that's ever happened on TV is one time Joel Hodgson, aka Joel Robinson of Mystery Science Theater fame, um, got a letter from a, a child that asked why he looked so sleepy. And he looked into the camera with the puffiest underlids in the history of marijuana abuse and said, I guess it's just my nature. I really think that's maybe the smartest moment that's ever occurred on television. <laughs> so just enjoy your nature, folks. That's my suggestion. Oh, hello. Play the fretted note. Play the fretted note and, and release the fatted cow. Wait, hold on. That joke would only be appropriate if I was playing Prodigy. Ha, 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 ha. A little Bible humor there. Okay. Pretty obviously something wrong with the cable. Oh, it's alright. Ah. Molto bene. Oops. Or not. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Wow, that was a nice recovery. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. <sighs> 20, 21, 22, 3, 4, 5, 6. I'm not going to die over the shield duck today. You know why, folks? Because defeat of deduct goes over defense before detail. The end. And I lost count over my stupid little rhyme. Not fast enough. Exterminate! Oh, I made it. Thirteen. Fourteen. No! I missed the nineteen! No! I'm gonna have to write a signed letter of apology for failing so badly in the upper... on the upper neck after watching an Ingve Malmsteen masterclass. Like, it's not his fault. I just obviously wasn't paying attention. Always a shield duck. That's my theory. Yeah. 
Uh, 12, 13. 14, 15. 16, 17. Probably should have gambled on that one. 17, 18. 19, 20. 21, 22, 23. Four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Thirty-one, thirty-two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ah! Oh! Blue blocker. Blue blocked by the blue duck. Man, I was so addicted to this game. <laughs> this, this game got me hooked on Rocksmith, something fierce. Because I wasn't good enough to play any songs at first. I might still not be. Four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. I was wrong about the ninth duck. Eighteen, nineteen. 20. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Sorry about the grunting. One, two, three, four, five. No gambling now. Hands are sweaty. Six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Fuck, red string, fuck! 14, oh, go to hell. 15, bullshit. 16. <laughs> red string top of the neck, that's... That's pretty much the death zone for me. Folks, uh, you may find this amusing, but my hands are not very big. Oh. <laughs> I, uh, I have a certain look about me, but my hand is actually, this is a normal, this isn't the, this isn't the big iPhone. <laughs> my, my hands are actually really quite small. Uh, it's great for some things, but when it comes to reaching all the way around the neck with precision, uh, not not so great. Fortunately, on a bass guitar, there's not really any good reason to play the heavy string all the way across because I can't reach it. <laughs> so it goes. I'm, a, I'm an average sized person, but I have very, very small fingers. Um, it's been quite useful in tech. I'm that guy that can reach down in the computer usually and get the small screws. Uh, I have the for good fortune of working with someone who actually has even thinner fingers than me, um, who may well someday be quite the classical guitar shredder as a result of that. Oops. Ah, complete goofus. Gallant remembers where the freaking notes are. Goofus just plays whatever his fingers hit. <laughs> Why, yes, I was raised in the South. Why do you ask? When they make, when they let me make the new version of this, oh, which apparently not. Apparently, I need to remember where the nine is. But when they let me make the new version of this, um, 
We'll use the new physics engine in like Unreal or Unity. And when you bend a shot, it'll actually curve towards whichever fret, you know, it'll curve up. That would be awesome. So if you technically play a 12, but the duck's on the 13, you just do a one step bend, a half step bend. And boom, you hit it. That actually, I had to write that one down. <laughs> Three, four, five, six, seven. Easy mode. Eight. Huh. Red uh, shield deck on the nine again. Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Okay. Interesting. Sixteen. Uh, uh, one point six million at sixteen shots. Don't know how relevant that is. It's above the seven. I'm working on it. Uh, Eighteen. 1920. Oh, back to the red string. Dang. 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. 30, uh, shield duck on the 29 again. Two. Oh, I let a duck escape. Oh, too slow. Dang. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight. Ah! <laughs> Heartbreaking. Heartbreaking failure on my part there. So it goes. I've been playing guitar for nearly an hour. Oh, oh. Okay. Brain's starting to fall apart. Time for a little break. Doing better not looking at the front. Oh, he said and then failed. Fuff. Fudge. Actually, not counting might be helping, like not trying. I mean, I'm just screwing around now and doing really quite well. Oops. Hmm, maybe I'm overthinking it. so close here, but I can feel my fingers giving out. Uh, Alright, time for another quick break. I will be back in no more than five to ten minutes. Thanks for watching. We really do appreciate having you. Um, if you're watching this stream and you wouldn't mind, please uh, like, subscribe, follow, and all that good stuff. And just let us know if what we're doing is going the right direction. If there's anything you'd like to see, comment, um, send me a message on Twitch, comment on YouTube video. Um, I'm very interested in knowing if any of this is interesting to anyone. Uh, I don't guarantee that it is or will be, but I do guarantee that I will keep trying and I will 
keep modulating my my formula like a like a Borg alien until I pierce through your indifferent shields and get you to follow the stream. So, thanks as always, and um, I'll be back. Alright, officially. What the hell? Oops, uh, pardon me folks, be right back.
Hey folks, I'm back. I apologize for that delay. Um, life. Life, it just, it puts so many things on you. And the only way to get that stress off of your shoulders is to play some cool music. So, I'm going to rapidly switch both instruments and hands and play a little right-handed bass. Apologies for the delay. I'm not 100% sure there's anybody even watching the stream right now. But I did say that I would stream today, and I'm trying to become more regular in that sense. So, hopefully, I will be here playing various music types for you um, when you tune in. If you are interested in that sort of stuff, then you've come to the right place, because we're playing bass show and face. Definitely thinks that's a guitar. There we go. Okay, so now that I know how the guitar duck game. game works, let's see what kind of scores I can get with the other instruments. This righty bass still in good tune. I love this thing. Um, I never thought I'd love a brown guitar. This thing is just so beautiful. I mean, it just makes me so happy. Um, something about it. Something about a nice, high-quality bass. Um, they just, they feel good in the hands. They're heavy. They feel like wealth. They're like nice furniture. <laughs> They're like nice furniture that you can play. Uh, it really, I really love them. Um, I wish I, I wish I had more basses. I would love to become one of those gear guys. If there's any kind of gear that you would like me to purchase and um, and play with. Uh, my budget is pretty low, but I was thinking about maybe getting my first pedal soon. So, if you have any suggestions, uh, what's the first pedal I should buy? Should I get a compressor? Should I get a looper? Should I get some sort of cool four-in-one that's kind of cheap because it's made um, out of fairly commonly available parts? Uh, let me know in the comments or in the chat um, what kind of guitar you think I should, uh, guitar accessory you think I should purchase next. I'm not sure this thing is quite in tune enough for Rocksmith. Oh, there we go. Woo, let's turn this all the way up. It's already all the way up. Okay. heavy-handed. My uh, probably gonna lose. Nice! Saved it. I don't know why it makes the laughter of the damned. I think that might be supposed to be some sort of duck noise, but it really does sound like uh, creatures from hell chortling. heavy-handed. Nice. Nice save. Just back and forth between the G and the A strings today. It'd be nice to play some of the other strings game. Ooh. I swear I'm on the 15th fret. Okay. It's time for the precision tuner.
poor finger control on that one. If I was ever so slightly more precise with that finger trail, I would be able to get the shield ducks really fast with it. I gotta practice. Base, base, base. That'd be a good video to. Okay, you play all you play all your base, and have all your bases out. That'd be just enjoyable all by itself, just for showing off the collection. Oh, dang it! This is what I get for playing on a five string. The game does not support it, and so I have to remember not not to use the big bad B string for anything, no matter how cool it sounds. Megalo C. The heck was that? The frick? My cell phone's connected to its uh, Bluetooth speaker, which is across the room. Okay, cool. Hey, actually getting to use the uh, A string for a bit. Alexa, office black light on. Oof, oof. I swear we have not used the D string once this entire uh, game. Fall, folks. That was the pickups, I swear. Gotta turn them down. Alright. Let's just ever so slightly mix these down. Wow, level five? What? What? <clears throat> Man, I'm behind on this. Still plenty of work to do. That's good news. I should have gambled. I should have played a little. Also, I gotta find out what I need to do to level up. I'm literally getting half points right now. Oof. Poor finger control. I let up ever so slightly and it changed the tone. Folks, I'm about to go buy so much beef and bread you wouldn't even believe it. It's about to be burger day. Every day is burger day. Also, it's always taco time now. No, seriously. I have apparently decided that I really like black beans, and that stuff is so good for you, and so cheap, that combined with the Zatarain spicy rice, I think I'm about to recreate a Freebird-style burrito, even though I'm too far from Texas to get a Freebird's. <laughs> Uh, I don't know why they don't have Freebirds in Las Vegas, man. It seems like it would be uh, very popular here, because people love some big food. There's literally a place where if you're dangerously overweight, they give you your food for free. Oh, oh, poorly tuned bass. Oh. Hurt. Oh. 
15 ducks of each color and I missed the other two because I'm not reading very quickly today apparently. Oops, well that's not gonna... Anyway. Alright, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, oh. <laughs> anyway, one. One, two, ah, three, four, three, four, five, six. Save it. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Ah, no, red string. No, I'm screwed. Go to the precision tuner. Hey, papa. Something as opposed to nothing. Technically, I've gotten a high score and a level. I don't know why I'm being so harsh today. Doesn't feel like I've accomplished anything. What? That's dead on. Hmm. Okay. But I mean, a thumbing is usually wrong. Perfectly in tune. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Let's fiddle with the pickup selector a little bit. Maybe I'm playing. Oh, I might be playing too low. I mean, that can't be helping. Uh oh. <laughs> I think I need different strings to do that or maybe a stronger hand.
sounds like it's some turn. Guitar key. Oh hey, yeah. No, I could do some slides. I'm not I'm not committed to any particular uh, exercise at this time on right-handed bass. Um, it's probably one of my weakest instruments, so. I'd say currently I'm falling behind really badly on drums and righty bass. Folks, I will be right back. Just one second. And I'm back. I'm gonna go a little long on this stream today, uh, just to make up for the fact that I spent so much time uh, in the other room. Great. And if anybody stuck with the stream through that, then I really do appreciate you. Uh, we will be back with, I hope, a little more involved content here soon.
come up with a few ideas for how to make this stream just a little bit more fun, hopefully. already have got one long. That's good news. Well, with that in mind, folks, I'm going to play for about five more minutes, and then I'm going to cut the stream, and hopefully I will be back with right-handed normal guitar and left-handed bass uh, later today, and that's if I do not get called away to my, uh, let's call it, vol volunteer gig uh, that I'm currently working. I don't know if it's a volunteer gig. Maybe they'll pay me. <laughs> That'd be nice. There's always the correct settings for each game, and it's usually a combination of knobs and style. Knobs and style would be a pretty decent name for a guitar repair shop. It's not like something out of a Harry Potter book. What? Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Just, uh, just being a noob with, a, with too many strings on that one. That sucks. I feel like I gotta do that one over, because I feel like that one could have been a win if I'd properly remembered that this is a B string, not an E string. Sometimes for Rocksmith, just to be a complete cheese lord, I've been known to tune the B string to an E string and just have two E strings so I can't screw up. But that's technically, that's not a good way to learn. But I don't currently have a working four string right-handed bass. I need to uh, crown, level and crown the frets on my horse, and I'm being very lazy about it, and not too terribly good about taking it to a shop either. Very nice. And off we go. But if you would like to help me send my base to a luthier, then please, by all means, um, follow this stream, tell your friends about it, 
and uh, we can make this a gear stream. Believe me, nothing would make me happier because um, people who do gear videos and gear streams get lots of free gear. And so that alone would definitely pique my interest. So if you're just interested in seeing a person like me with a bit of a technical background, um, maybe peering into the inner workings of things like amps or something, uh, I would be happy to get that started. I would be willing to invest a bit since there are a few new toys that I could stand to get. not bad though for an opening. Really at any level. I guess I can count from here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen. Because I'm pretty sure that the rainbow ducks do not count. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 19, no, 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 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 25, 26, now we're, now we're going somewhere. 27, 28, we've gone gold. Oh, oh damn. Within the base after us. <sighs> Again, I don't know why you would ever want to be down here on a freaking E base E string. I can't believe I got a high score that high on level six. That's um I must be remembering how to do this. Move up the charts. Oh, no, ch no chart movement. My other hand must be. Woo! <laughs> 73 millions. That's, uh, I think I've allowed my right hand to lag a little bit behind my left hand on this one. And with that in mind, uh, I am going to briefly lag out of the stream, and then I will be back, hopefully, in no more than about an hour with the inverse of these two guitars. And then, if you'll tolerate it, I might even play a little bit of piano. I'm not yet confident with the drums or the saxophone to the point of putting them on air, but I think my piano playing might actually be getting half good. Um, so hopefully you'll join me for that. I do appreciate having you here. Thanks for joining me here at Multi Music Map. Uh, real quick, we're just going to demo the brand new Multi Music Map logo. This was created by a fan, and I do appreciate her work, and I hope that she will contribute more uh, similar type things to the stream because I want this to be a unique experience and a participatory one at that. All right, thanks uh, for listening. I'll be back.